On Thursday, during a United Nations General Assembly resolution, six countries, namely Belarus, North Korea, Syria, Eritrea, Mali, and Nicaragua, sided with Russia in opposing the declaration for peace in Ukraine. In contrast, 141 countries voted for the end of hostilities in Ukraine and for Russia to withdraw its forces. Although the resolution does not mandate Russia to leave Ukraine, it represents an international condemnation of Moscow's aggression. Compared to the four countries that voted against a similar resolution in October, this vote shows a slight increase in opposition. Mali and Eritrea abstained from the previous vote but joined the six countries opposing the resolution this time. These six countries have close military ties with Russia. Belarus attempted to remove much of the resolution's language through proposed amendments, but they were overwhelmingly rejected. During Thursday's vote, some countries, including South Africa, China, and India, chose to abstain. However, Ukrainian Foreign Minister Dmitro Kuleba still saw the 141-7 vote as a triumph, representing global support for Ukraine. Kuleba emphasized that many countries from Latin America, Africa, and Asia voted in favor of the resolution, defying the notion that the global South does not stand with Ukraine. Friday marked one year since the Russian military invasion of Ukraine. The ongoing war has led to the death of tens of thousands of people, the destruction of entire Ukrainian cities, and higher food and fuel prices worldwide.